The UCAS deadline. The UCAS equal consideration deadline is in January. This means that whether you applied at the start of September or on deadline day, your application will have an equal chance of success. If you apply after the January UCAS deadline, your application will no longer be guaranteed equal consideration. So you might miss out on your first choice as courses start to fill up or perhaps close completely for applications. Applying after the deadline. Applying to university after the January deadline isn't anything to worry about. It's important to remember that there are always options available. Most universities accept applications until the end of June if places are still available. You'll still need to apply through UCAS and provide a personal statement and reference. UCAS Extra. You are eligible to apply through UCAS Extra if you have used all five choices on UCAS and find yourself without an offer, or you have changed your mind and declined your offers or withdrawn your choice. Extra is open between February and July, and you can apply for any course with vacancies on an individual basis. You can only have one extra choice at a time, so if you receive an offer through Extra, you must either accept it as your firm choice or decline it. If you don't get the offer you want in Extra, don't worry, you can apply through Clearing. Clearing. New applications made after the end of June will automatically be considered through Clearing. Clearing opens in July, and we recommend that you apply as soon as you can so that you'll have more choice of courses. What is Clearing? Clearing is your chance to apply for an undergraduate course if you haven't got a place at your firm or insurance choice, you've changed your mind about what or where you want to study, you haven't yet applied, or you've done even better than expected and want to explore new opportunities. How to apply. To apply through Clearing, you'll need your results, including GCSEs or equivalent, so that the university can match you with their course entry requirements. Clearing vacancies are advertised on university websites and on UCAS. Your full contact details, including address, telephone and email. And your UCAS and clearing number. You'll find your clearing number in your application on UCAS. What happens when you get a clearing offer? You may receive multiple offers and it's important that you make the right choice that's right for you. You can only accept one, so research the course and the university in detail before you respond. When you've decided, you'll need to go to UCAS and select Add Clearing Choice. This will then show as an acceptance on your Choices page in UCAS. The UCAS application process can move quickly, but that doesn't mean you should rush your decision. Uni will be your new home away from home, not just a place to study, and research is a valuable part of the process. Take a virtual tour, attend an open day or campus tour, review the course content online and chat with staff and students to ensure that you know you've found your perfect university.